Hey there everyone, welcome back to my channel once again, this is McKellar. And this video here is just a continuation of my own perspective of The Sims 4 gameplay review. So, continue on to staying in tuned with this. Sit back and enjoy the show. And now that we have already discussed about cats, now here is the other topic which is about, which is about dogs in The Sims. So here is, here is Ricardo, and he has two dogs in his house, which is uh, Wolfie right here, and where is the other one? Uh, I'm just going to quickly check here. Oh, the other one right here. This one right here, <laughs> playing on one of those balls, that's hilarious. This one right here is Daisy. Now here's a bit of a fun fact for you guys. Daisy is an actual dog that that very much looks similar to this dog right here. And that dog uh well, I I don't own a dog. I don't own a dog like this one here, but I do know that a buddy of mine who ha who's like been to like the whole part of a construction business and so on, he owns a dog like that and her name is Daisy. So right here, here is uh, the 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 home of uh, so here uh, this guy right here, which is Ricardo Martino or Martino, whatever. So let's go ahead and explore the whole part about about dogs. Now, pretty much the opposite of cats. Let's see what kind of fun little thing we can do with dogs. Gives. Special smooches, whatever the hell that is, but we'll we'll explore it, see how that how that goes. Pet, uh, yeah, we have a smart dog and have and have and have a intellectual discussion. It's like okay, there's something you don't really see every day. Um, lick the face. Now let's see here. <clears throat> Scratch's favorite spot. Quacks in us. Uh -huh. Dad! Whoa! <laughs> Tombra! <laughs> oh, Mishi Oba. Elfris Yambara. Inar. Tananiwa. Lamejo Kaba. Fwiss, fwiss. Cardinal Moon. <laughs> Yabano Boojing, would you? I'm surprised you can understand him. Ah, Arogaba. Ah, Vipitab. Balfoy. Gribix. Whoa. Oh, 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 Yibs. Ah, uh huh. Okay, well, I'll have a look at that later on. And see what else here. Oh, yeah, you can get this dog to go potty. And you also get to play with the, play with the dog. Kanazoi Sneeb. Oh, oh. Oh, yes, you can get the dog to do that. Here we go. Huh? Oh, oh. <laughs> to room. <laughs> Bancha. This is now <laughs> them both playing the dog. <laughs> Oopla. <laughs> oh, Sharba. <laughs> Bench we. Oh, <laughs> Uspa. <laughs> Oh, oh, Conga Lord. Oh, <laughs> Chibi. Oh, Sharba. Oh, Arpanoi. Ah, Barumus Tenquil. Like I say, their type of uh, gibberish language is quite comical, to say the most. Okay, so what I'm going to just show here, like I brought some of these type of little uh, animal toys out here. Just to kind of 
Ah, so yeah, no command to use. Well, he's already out there, so it's my, might as well. And yes, you can you, you can train dogs to do something like this. There is a whole section of training dogs. And what the hell is this now? Do sit-ups. What? No, no, no. Okay. Uh. Oh, because he's got like a shitload of energy. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, let's see here. I suppose I'll get him to do it again. Oh, uh huh. Rove. <laughs> oh, Womper. Ooh, Pandole Farmu. See, there you go. Now, let's go ahead and get them to use one of these damn things. Command to use. Let's go with Daisy here. Switch things up a bit. Ah, the Sawa. Tear up the Sawa. Lark him. Ringlar yeeds Habata. Varpasa Dibawis. Wabarani Zimze. La Jolla Merch. Okay, well, since the dog is still right there, why not let him keep going? Or let her keep going, I should say. Uh-huh. Rove. Oh! Jisapa Bwef. Watani Chof. Oh my god. The gibberish they come up with, I swear. Okay, whatever. Uh, okay, so... There's other things that I have been just messing around with here. Uh, let's see here. Mm. Train fetch with. I suppose I can get Wolfie to do that for the hell of things. Just continue switching things up a bit. Okay, it's gonna come over here here we go and considering the fact now this is the part that I was talking about if you want to train any of your sims into skills or anything like that considering the fact in the whole sim time so to speak it is like 11 10 p.m. and look at this see the needs are still up no need to worry Vubia. slow Not bad, hey. Not bad at all. Lance Jabula, thank. Uh... Is he gonna toss it again? Shingul, Rabinu, Skamaj, Yuma. Mm-hmm. What the hell, buddy? No, 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 no. Toss that damn thing again. Yekla. Banaj? Vobia! Slow! Scumaj! Okay, go ahead, buddy. Let's go. How the hell did that dog not know where he tossed the damn thing? Oh my god, are you freaking kidding me? Ah, it's like, are you, you, you gotta be serious, you damn little mutt. Oh, whoa, shibu. <laughs> okay, now let's do this again. <laughs> there we go. The, the, the dog, are you kidding me? The ball's like right underneath her nose. Ah. 
How about that? Daisy has the brains oh, for sure. Shushka. Shall be if <laughs> your ib Pudge sick of foos. Okay, good enough, buddy. Just good enough, whatever. Well, I'm pretty sure oh. I'll get the gist of it. Some of these sims need to really just like, oh my god, these sims can be a little bit dumb at times. And that's when I believe the sim is going to do some stretches. Oh. There we are. Okay. Now, got to talk to this, uh, this, uh, this little mutt right here. Let's see if we missed anything. I don't think so. Oh, by the way, there is that whole, um, what the hell is it? Oh, yeah. So, now I can also, as well, train these dogs into do various things. Like such as this. Oh, yeah, and there's that whole Simstagram pet. It's like also like Instagram. But, you know, like, obviously, you're, obviously none of your animals are going to be so-called, like, you know, uh, you know, fitness models or whatever like that. These dogs... Like these dogs just get posted online, and everyone's like, "Oh, this this dog is so cute," and whatever. Um, let's see here. Uh, I oh, there's the training part. Yes. So let's do the whole lie down. I'm just gonna do uh, do a few of these here for all of you here. So I'm pretty sure that you will get the gist of it here. Cubeppa, foiba, wobba, wobba. Oh, yes. Oh. Ah. <laughs> so, yes, you can be able to train Boy these dogs to do the, these, these various types of tricks. Oh, Foiba, wobba, wobba. Uh huh. Gibsy. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Excellent. Okay, so what I'll do for the hell of things now is do the whole mating part where I'm going to get these two to start so-called making like Marvin Gaye and uh, so-called get it on. And these two can start producing uh, puppies. Okay, so now that they're both here, encourage Wolfie to breed with. And there's Daisy. Okay, here we go. <laughs> now it's going to be the same type of thing that, that you're going to be seeing here. Chum chum. Okay. Here we go. Ah, the sawa. Tear up the sawa. Uh huh. See right there. <laughs> yep, we all know where this is going. Okay, let's see if I can angle this here. So, when it comes to the same thing on how these pets would mate, it's the same. It's the same thing, uh, the same type of way with cats. Watch this. <laughs> yes, that's how these dogs so-called mated. Yinba, Wefa, ah, Nilshaba. What's this one say? Oh, praise. Tumba Rimple. <laughs> oh my God, Giddy. My <laughs> Daisy. Okay, you'll get there, no problem. So let's start giving this, uh, feeling the love for this, for this little puppy, for this little dog here. 
No, just get back there. Dad! Whoa! <laughs> Tom, bro! <laughs> oh, and th this dog here uh, should be, uh, you know, getting pregnant, and, you know, I'm pretty sure that uh, Ricardo himself over here will, will be notified about that. Uh, what else here? Um, okay, well, I'm just trying to think here now. I don't, well, I don't know if I can find any, let's see here. Let's see what kind of toys that would be for, for dogs. Oh, clean up. I don't think I've ever seen, I think I've ever seen this option. Okay. Seems like Ricardo's not very bright. Just looked, just uh, picked up one of those some balls and placed it back down and again. It's like, really, buddy? Seriously? Uh. Meanwhile, check out this type of very interesting kind of like, uh, um, this shower here. Now, I'm pretty sure you're not going to really find this in any kind of appliance or any type of hardware store. I'd be very surprised if you could, but I doubt it, but I'm just going to show you guys something here. Expecting puppies. Congratulations. Daisy is expecting. Uh, there are going to be some new little paws around the household. Holy shit, this yes. guy is very energetic. Okay, there you guys go. Just wanted to show you about that little shower thing. Okay. Go for a jog. Why the hell not? Now, I'm hoping that since this, this is just a game, I should not... This sim should not have to be, you know... Have, Having its, you know, his life at risk and getting jumped or something. Okay, or are we gonna do this or what? Okay, there we go. Is this guy gonna go anywhere or what? I'll have to do the same thing for Wolfie as well. So, like I said before, guys, this is just to kind of show you the whole little in depth about uh, of like what, what of what it is like to take care of, and take care of pets on The Sims here. Because I know that when I used to uh, when I used to play various types of the uh, the whole Sim the whole Sim games, like uh, the ones on like the one on uh, the PS2, clearly you didn't have this option at all whatsoever. Then again, during that time period, like about 15 years ago, there was no type of option of, like, um, any kind of form of a, you know, DLCs and downloadable content, which we have now, which is which is pretty nice and convenient. Alright, there we go. Quacks and us. Uh -huh. Guys feeling freaking confident already. What the hell? Oh. Oh yeah, wait a minute. There's, there's another little interesting device I had purchased not too long ago. And I thought, yeah, I'll go ahead and have a look at this damn thing. See what uh, kind of surprise I can do with this here. Now, I forget what the hell this thing is called. It's a future cube. That's what it's called. So, ask about scientific mystery, ask about love life, creative ideas, uh, ask a question. Sure, what the hell, I'll see how this goes. Uh. 
Not today, champ. <laughs> you should me. Oh, it's like one of those eight ball type of things. Okay, okay, hold on. Just, just chill. Everything's all good. Um, let's see here. As for creative ideas, what the hell? Let's ha let's see how this is gonna go. I knew this was already available in this game, but I didn't know what the hell this was. Inspi inspiration will come to you soon. Huh? <laughs> well, I'm gonna just cancel this. Beru! Yen for Allah! Okay, let's see. <laughs> I have never seen this before myself personally. Ask about uh, scientific mysteries. Huh. I didn't realize they had those eight balls Ooh. on here. See, the, the mysteries of the universe shall be revealed with study. Steba! Finale! <laughs> this is very expressive, I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I'm like, what the hell is this? Is it really? Ask about love life. I uh, don't really care much about that, but we'll see. Huh? A plunge! <laughs> That's okay. It's not like women know what they're... I'm just no. I'm, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna strike from that comment. Anyway, <laughs> uh, let's see here. Well, okay. What else? Ask a question again. This is interesting. How the like? It's like it's an ape on here. I didn't even realize that. And the way he's responding to these kind of, kind of comments. Or these statements, rather. Huh? Oh, bombs. Don't be d sh daft or something. Oh, I... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. This is just hilarious as hell. Uh -huh. Why does he do that? Oh, um, no. <laughs> okay, well, you're gonna go clean it up, so clean the damn thing up. Let's see what I can get this guy to do. I suppose I can do that. Well, there's other features on here we didn't explore anyways. Holy shit, buddy. I only had tried the whole jogging once, and that was on a different sim, though. So now I'm just kind of looking at it and saying, okay, well, let's see what, what goes on here. Like, these are just other features I'm exploring on here, seeing, you know, what you can do on here and whatever. Nice little beach. This guy's got a lot of freaking energy right now. I'm trying to get him to burn some off. Oh, nice little nice little poochie. Not bad of a little area, I have to admit. I believe we're going back to the house here, and yep, we are. Okay, there we go. There we are. Excellent. <laughs> I don't. Oh my God! Did he? Did he really? 
Yes, he really... Okay, well, that's not a problem, because technically I can fix that. One second here. Mm. Well, I can jump in the shower right now and start washing down, or... <sighs> just going to... Uh, one second here. There we go. And then all we have to do... Now his needs are up. And now... His needs won't decay. His hygiene is fully good. His hygiene is great. Alright now. And is that... Yeah it is. I think these dogs are puking up or something. Next time I catch him in the act, I'm going to give them a bit of a lecture on that. Well, so those were quite the interesting little features I've never seen on here. And... Haha, <laughs> cute. Okay, now I'll just have to... Okay, well, I guess what I'll do is just see about... Maybe get him to, uh, let's see here. I guess what I'll get him to do is, like, play a game or something like that and just kind of get the whole waiting game out until the dog Daisy begins to, you know, start producing puppies. Uh -huh. And I will go ahead and show that in, in the next clip. Okay, now time has already passed, and guess what? I'm going to just do a little bit of a camera trick and zoom in right, eh, zoom in pretty tight on this. Here is Daisy. Daisy is is pregnant, and Daisy is now officially going into labor. Okay, now I'll just I'll just continue on. For, having the camera follow her until she does deliver the puppies. Okay, let's see how she is. I don't know what the hell Ricardo is doing. Okay, so. See how she's reacting here. Oh. My apologies for the uh, little off-angle camera there. Okay, so, she's going outside. She's going to have the puppies outside, is she? She's going to find a little spot to get these puppies out. Yep, she's trying to find a place. Yep, tongue's out. You can tell she's painfully in labor and she's about to have those puppies. Well, at least you don't have those weird ass type of machines of getting those puppies out or let alone, uh, you know, a dog like this doesn't have to go to one of those bassinets and, you know, just kind of push the push those puppies out. Yeah. Daisy's trying to find a spot. <laughs> I don't know why Ricardo's feeling all flirty. He's probably rock watching some kind of romantic little show, just a guess. Under the father's coming out, saying, oh my gosh! You know, you, can you just imagine, like, you know, Wolfie over, Wolfie over there, he's gonna, like, make, like, one of those, uh, you know, Father Simmons, like, oh, blah, 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 start, like, jumping around or whatever, like, in a panic kind of mode. That'd be funny as hell, though, but I don't think that's gonna happen. Oh yeah, 
She's in labor and she's trying to find a spot to get these kids, try to get these puppies out. I keep on saying and get, get these kids out. Daisy, honey, what are you doing? Is that hard for you to try and find a spot, or what gives? Let's see what uh, Wolfie is saying. Petting Wolfie, okay, whatever. boy. <laughs> Miss <laughs> Oogalump. Yeah, I'll imagine what if he's saying, uh, uh, we're, we're going in a pack. Uh, no, uh, my my doggy friend is about to have like puppies. <laughs> Does it take this long for uh, for a dog to try and find a spot? Uh oh, guess what, people? Yep, Daisy's about to Daisy chose her spot. She's about to have those puppies right away. Okay, well, I guess this, this spot will have to do. Here we go. Here goes nothing. And. <laughs> How about that? Daisy just gave birth to a puppy. What would you like to call her? So it's a female puppy. Just like her mommy. Okay, so... No, I'm not gonna call it Daisy. Sweetie? Eh, I don't know. Let's see what... Rosie's a cute little puppy name. What the hell? Uh, and Daisy just gave birth to a puppy. Would you like to call her another, another little female puppy? Cinnamon, Ginger. I'm not naming a damn puppy Burger. Well, I can't really say that. I know that uh, I have once met a cat named Burger, but that's beside the point. Ah, uh, Doris Nova. Missy, I suppose, why not? <laughs> Here we go. Now, Although this is very cute to even have a look at this, and yes, those, those puppies are, those, one second, let me just angle the camera right, those puppies are quite cute and adorable, and, oh yes, these, these puppies are quite cute and adorable. Uh, now, this is what I'm talking about, it's the same thing when I was, when I, what I had mentioned about, about, um, about the cat Pookie when she had delivered the when she had gave birth to those or quote unquote gave birth to those kittens. Now this is exactly what I was talking about with the puppies with the with um um Daisy. I was thinking of Muffin for some reason. That's a different story. Uh, Daisy was was giving birth to those puppies. Now if those puppies right there. Okay, see right there. Now, that little vibrant type of uh, hyperactive kind of movement. Okay, now typically, now, I'm not a huge top-notch type of an animal expert per se, but the way I'm looking at this is, once again, this doesn't seem to kind of look right to me anyways. Don't get me wrong, those puppies are quite cute, but again, this doesn't seem to look right because if those puppies were to be freshly born, as in like newborns, those puppies again would look rather fairly roughly like very small and look very roughly similar to mice and 
and those puppies would be like you know just be making those cute little barks and and uh, sucking on the mother on the on on the female old dogs you know nipples in order to get the milk and whatever and again same thing applies either on a blank on a thick blanket or in a box in a blanket while the dog is the dog is with with uh with its young and for these puppies right here to be a little grown up especially at that size and already you know being conscious of what's going on and being vibrant and running around and so on my first thought was okay these puppies are supposed to be freshly born and this doesn't even look right because already these puppies are are like already walking their their eyes are wide open and they're running and they're already running around my very first thought was again that does not look right because if, if these puppies were supposed to be born they'd be much smaller and look kind of roughly similar to like mice and be like you know um, gipping away and sucking on on the, on the mom's nipples for milk. These puppies are not, are not even doing that. And this is the reason why I had mentioned about the whole part that these puppies here, you know, at that size, if they're already kind of being all jumpy and running around at that, and they're already that sm that little big like that, and you know their eyes are wide open and they're already running around and whatever, that'd be like once again similar as I mentioned before in the last clip. That'd be rather similar before. Um, hold on. Sorry about that. Uh, the commentary uh, was uh, briefly kind of cut for a moment here. I had an incoming kind of call, so I had a I had to very quickly take that. It was an important call, so I had to take that and get that done out of the way. So, anyways, like I was mentioned before, like I said, like uh, to try and summarize this up, the puppies, uh, the pu those puppies at that size, to rather kind of like uh, similar to um, the kittens in the previous clip at that size. Firstly, uh, firstly, I've already had been given birth already. My first thought was, okay, this does not look right, because as I had had mentioned of what those puppies would literally be looking like once they're freshly born, and those puppies at that size, already running around, uh, doing whatever, and already their eyes open and so on. My very first thought was, okay. Those puppies being at that size, their eyes are wide open, and they're just kind of jumping around, you know, and whatever. That, at that size, already at that kind of stage, <coughs> pardon me. That'd be rather similar to, um, a preg a pregnant sim giving birth to her child, and once that that pregnant sim has already given birth to her child. The child would be coming out of the mother in a form of a toddler or a child, not a baby. That that's kind of like the whole that's kind of like the whole uh, the whole thought what, what I was thinking about. My first when I especially when I looked at these puppies, my very first thought was, okay, although those puppies are cute and although those kittens are cute, that does not look right. Just again something I was just kind of looking at and it just kind of occurred to me like. Uh, as much as this is cute, I, I, that doesn't, that looks rather off. So anyways, like I said before, that's just kind of like the review that I, that I just wanted to mention about because that's when I say, okay, if those puppies are going to be at that size, then that means that once a pregnant sim gives birth to her child, then that child will come out not as a baby, but as like a toddler or a child. And again, right there, that, that does not at all make any sense. So that was just my little observation on that one. Okay, so I'll go ahead and grab da, 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 da. grab Ricardo here, and see now that now these now these puppies here, these these little cute little uh, puppies here already have their different their different kind of fur. I'll go ahead and interact with. Uh, <laughs> that's funny as hell. Pet. Let's see what I could do with this. Uh, I probably already had done that. But let's see what I have. Pet, uh, petting Missy, petting Missy. Yeah, I've already done that. If I do that again, I'm pretty sure Ricardo will be like. <laughs> as in, like, being all, being all confused, and I don't want that. Mm -hmm. 
Let's explore and find interesting things. Really? So Daisy is an official happy mama. And now, here's Ricardo. Ah, <laughs> Yanabi! Quobi Mimna! Congra Congratulations, Sir Wolfie. You're a proud papa. Oh, yibs. Oh, these these puppies are just adorable. Even though they're or they look they would appear to be at that whole type of uh, toddler or child stage. Ah, Yinba, Wefa, and okay, so has to go uh, has to go potty. Let's see what I can get this dog to do. Request a song. Oh, I didn't know dogs can do that. Uh, okay, I guess give Is treat. Sure, the blue. Meh. <laughs> Melvoy. <laughs> Yazip. <laughs> That's cute. Garbafa. With toy. Ah, uh, shit. Let's see about what else I can get this dog to do. Uh, I guess give this little poochie a hug. Sure, we haven't seen that. Uh, ch -ch -ch. What else can we get him, hit, get her to do? Uh, do a little praising. Mm. Sure, get, get her to sing a bit. No, Scabado. Oh, <laughs> it's cute. Canopy. Okay, what the hell is he gonna do here? Give praise to Okay, well that's pretty much the whole the whole dogs in the puppy section right there. And yeah, as much as these these puppies are a little cute, like I said, that's just my my little explanation about Rosie, Rosie and Missy. That's just my little explanation about what, uh, like, as much as these puppies are cute, the, the whole details about the puppies were a little off, especially after they were just given birth, after, uh, um, whatchamacallit, Daisy just finished giving birth to them. So again, that's just my little, my little, my little take on that. And, uh, I don't know what else that I can go ahead and explore and do, per se. Um... Okay, in that case, you know, don't really worry about that. We'll just go ahead and move on.